Imagine looking into a mirror that does not simply show your reflection, but instead reveals the earliest moments of time itself. It feels impossible, yet modern astronomy has reached a point where this idea is no longer fantasy. When you look deeper into space, you are not just seeing stars, you are witnessing a cosmic time machine that allows us to view events that happened billions of years before humans even existed. It is one of the most mind-bending ideas in science, yet it is completely real. Light travels at a finite speed, meaning the farther away an object is, the older the light we receive from it becomes. So when astronomers observe a galaxy that is billions of light years away, they are not seeing that galaxy as it is today, but as it was in the distant past, at a time when the universe itself was incredibly young. Many scientists describe this as, watching the universe grow up. The deeper we look, the farther back in time we travel, almost like peeling away the layers of cosmic history. For decades, scientists believed that the early universe must have been a slow, soft, and simple place. They imagined giant clouds of dark gas beginning to settle, slowly forming the first tiny stars and the earliest baby galaxies. These galaxies, they thought, would be small, messy, and chaotic clusters of light, nothing more than simple building blocks just starting to form structure. But then came the James Webb Space Telescope, often called the most powerful eye humans have ever pointed at the universe. When Webb sent back its first images, astronomers were shocked. Instead of small, chaotic baby galaxies, it revealed fully formed, mature galaxies with spiral arms, bright central regions, thick clouds of stars, and even signs of supermassive black holes, features that should only appear after billions of years of cosmic evolution. The discovery felt so strange that one scientist described it as expecting to find a newborn baby but finding a full-grown adult standing in the crib. This single phrase captured the confusion of the scientific community. Something in our understanding of the early universe was clearly not correct. Either galaxies formed much faster than expected, or our theories needed major revisions. These galaxies existed only about 300 to 400 million years after the Big Bang, which is incredibly early considering the universe is now around 13.8 billion years old. Yet these galaxies looked old, bright, and extremely well organized. Dr. Emma Chapman, an astronomer studying the early universe, said the telescope is showing us things that should not exist yet. Her reaction became a symbol of how deeply Webb is challenging long held scientific ideas. Many researchers compared this discovery to finding ancient pyramids built just weeks after humans supposedly emerged. The timeline simply did not make sense based on older theories. Every new web image made the mystery deeper. Not only were early galaxies larger and older than expected, but they were forming stars at incredible speeds, producing light far brighter than astronomers predicted. One of the most shocking mysteries involved heavy elements like carbon, oxygen, silicon, and iron. These elements usually form inside stars and they appear only after several generations of stars are born, live, and die. This process normally takes billions of years. Yet Webb found heavy elements in galaxies that existed extremely early on. Dr. Jacob Bean commented that this discovery defies our expectations for how quickly stars could have lived and died. If true, it means the early universe was far more active and energetic than we ever imagined. These heavy elements are also the building blocks of life, especially carbon and oxygen. Their early appearance raises a fascinating question, if the ingredients for life formed so quickly, could primitive life have emerged somewhere else long before it appeared on Earth? While we do not have evidence of alien life, the discovery suggests that the universe may have been preparing for life much earlier than scientists previously believed. Another extraordinary discovery was the presence of huge black holes inside young galaxies. Normally, black holes grow slowly over billions of years as they collect gas, dust, and stars. But Webb found black holes that were already more than a billion times the mass of our Sun when the universe was still incredibly young. 
Dr. Andrew Ponson commented that, we're seeing black holes that grew too big, too fast, suggesting that something unusual was happening in the early universe. To explain this, some scientists believe that early black holes may not have formed from dying stars at all. Instead, they might have formed through direct collapse, where massive clouds of gas collapsed instantly under their own gravity, forming enormous black holes in a single step. Others propose that dark matter, the mysterious invisible substance making up most of the universe's mass, could have accelerated the growth of these giant black holes by pulling gas toward them much more quickly. Webb's discoveries force scientists to rethink everything they believed about how galaxies form. Instead of a calm, slow universe, it appears that the early cosmos was fast, chaotic, and unbelievably creative. Galaxies were building themselves quickly, stars were being born at extreme rates, and black holes were. Astrobiologist Dr. Natalie Batala said that, life's chemistry may begin far earlier and in far more places than we ever imagined. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.